Look with nature's eyes. Look with nature's eyes, with atomic eyes, with Eden eyes, with primordial eyes. Stand on nature's feet, on terrestrial feet, on stardust feet, on Big Bang feet. Touch with nature's hands, with sapling hands, with reverent hands, with unprecedented hands. Think with nature's mind, with undomesticated mind, with wild mind, with ineffable mind. Let trees erupt from your cells, release the bats from their cages in your skull. This is the place where scriptures and doctrines turn to gum leaves, and we can't remember what was written on them, but we marvel at their beauty. Let the stillness teach us how to move. Let the spaces between our thoughts teach us how to think. We are humble students of the great emptiness upon which this universe has been scribbled by a baby god in crayon. The baby's laughter echoes through our caverns and withers our precious minarets and turns our manifestos into tadpoles, bouncing innocently and non-judgmentally off all our houses of cards and going burbling down the stream while our empires implode behind it. And now here we stand, with crumbling egos on a dying planet, Surrounded by frogs the size of Volkswagens, the size of skyscrapers, the size of moons. This is a strange, strange place, and it is only getting stranger, and none of the tools in our toolbox are fit for the job. I have buried my old toolbox in the backyard with a horse's placenta and a box of Time magazines. A tree now grows there which has leaves that drip oil, and fruit which tastes like the Reagan administration. Those old tools have no use here. I walk away from them on nature's feet into the hatching of this new world.